Morning. Today I'm going to a really interesting place. There's some place I never thought I would ever go, but uh, a couple of friends recommended it, so I'm gonna go check it out. But before that, I feel like I need a sandwich, and there's a 7-Eleven right here. I'm a horseradish sauce. Man, this country, I'm telling you, this country and their sandwiches. Oh, it's good roast beef sandwich. Okay, now we're gonna go to this place that I, I never thought I would ever go before. So, mm. nice shot of time. As soon as you get downstairs, this is what you see. It's like a Hello Kitty stained glass window. I really don't know much about Hello Kitty beyond the fact that the company tries to claim that it's not, not actually a cat, she's just a little girl, but come on. I, I know what a cat looks like, that's a cat. Beyond that, I don't know much about this, but apparently in San Rio Puerto Land, which is where I'm going, there's some interesting food items. That's why I wanna go exploring this place, because I'm in Japan, you know? I wanna do something really, really interesting that revolves around food, and I think this will be fun. Yeah, I'm trying to convince myself that right now. Even the tickets are cute. I'm in. Uh, I, I don't really know what to do at this point because I think I'm the only guy here without a kid. It's like the most, the most adorable desserts ever. There's a buffet in here. Restaurant Yakata. I guess she owns it. Pork shabu shabu salad. Looks like chicken and an omelet egg. Cheesy omelet looking thing. Mini hamburger steak. Huh. It's like little miniature Salisbury steak looking things. Squid ink pasta. This looks halfway decent. This looks like egg whites. Oh, I just destroyed this little ghost looking thing. This is really interesting. Make your own ramen. So I think you put the ramen in the water. Yeah. Add some soil broth. Oh, I think it's dangerous to put so much hashu in front of me. Let's get like a little stack here. A little fish cake, the essence of any noodle dish. Oh, this might be really, really good. Kalpas plus Fanta melon soda. Now, of course, I've eaten at a lot of really good buffets in my day. I don't expect this to really be one of those. Very, very adventurous for me because, I, because I'm completely out of my element here. Come to such an interesting place like this and try out the food, I think it's pretty fun. And I got a bunch of stuff. Squid ink pasta, omelets, rice. I got some shabu shabu salad, some seaweed. Got a little bowl of ramen. Got some curry. And I got, and I got my kelpa soda with some sort of melon in there. Squid ink pasta is pretty chewy. Lacks a little flavor. The codfish they serve with mayonnaise, that wasn't half bad. This is the little ghost omelet dish that I got over rice. Okay, that's a pretty good omelet. Well, this country, really, when it comes to eggs, they don't mess up much. I think the best thing on that buffet was the codfish. It's actually pretty nice. Everything else tastes exactly what I think a buffet should taste like in a Hello Kitty theme park. Exactly. You know what? That char shoe is not bad. I will give them points on the texture of the noodles. Pretty chewy. 
this is yummy. Oh. All right, maybe the dessert's better. Really hoping the dessert is better. And it is. And look, I'm not coming here expecting this to be amazing food. I'm just telling you the way it is. I'm just telling you if it's good or not. I'm still having, I'm still having fun trying everything. I found something I like. This cheesecake, this is not bad. Actually pretty fluffy. It's got a good crust on it. Something's happening right now, I'm not really sure. People are getting really excited. Oh, it's Hello Kitty! Hello Kitty! I couldn't show you much of that because of copyright reasons. Well, that's pretty interesting. Also, sesame pudding here, not too bad either. Sitting here at the cafeteria, <clears throat> sorry, dining room, and as soon as Hello Kitty stuff came out, Everyone rushed out of here. Um, only people left me here are the dads. <laughs> like, I'm not gonna show, show any of them on screen, but like, they're falling asleep, they're sitting there. Uh, so, anyway, <laughs> that was kind of funny. All right, I'm gonna go look for more food now. Sanrio Rainbow World Restaurant, and this is your staff. Hey, uh, food's gonna be better than the buffet, right? Maybe. It's just, it's just Tama laying on top of some roast beef and some rice and some gravy. Oh, I hate to do this. I don't like it when my food has eyes staring up at me. Even though the eyes are, you know, stuck on there. Oh, sorry Tama. Oh. Oh, sorry buddy. Now he looks like a yellow ghost. I, I don't think this is made for, for a guy my size. But I'm using it. <laughs> Just in case some rice falls and I wanna eat it back up like a horse. All right, well, I'm sorry, but I'm hungry. Best thing I had here so far, by far. This is actually delicious. Oh yeah. I'm shocked right now. I mean, it's actually delicious. Rice is great. The sauce, fantastic. The roast beef, really, really tender. Hello Kitty Bento Box. Whoa. Inside the Bento Box, got a little rice. Some sugar, carrots, fish cake, little sausage, fried croquette or something, shredded eggs, rice. This is a really adorable looking bento box. I mean, this is for sure a kid's meal, but it's just really, really cute. This is a dessert. Look at that fried sweet corn cake. Actually, not too bad. I mean, come on. You're getting the bento box for the bento box, not really for what's inside. All right, kids and Hello Kitty lovers, maybe look away for a second. All I can say is, Fun little kids pinto. This is full on a milk pudding with whipped cream on top. That's a lot of cream. That's a lot of cream. Mm. Oh, a little too much for me. So the inside is it looks like just a massive tree house and a bunch of rides and just like Disneyland, the line for the rides looks like they're an hour long. Okay, some sort of parade. Like a, like a big parade. Everybody's putting their collective breaths right now.
I've got to say, that was actually a really well-made show. Good choreography, I like the acrobatics, but I think this place is getting to be cuteness overload for me, so one more plate of food, then I gotta get out of here. And check out what I got. This is the most adorable thing I ordered today. Hello Kitty Curry. I think I would love any girl that would use Spam as a hair ribbon. This is the nutritious curry. Oh man, I don't even know what to do. I don't want to hurt her, you know, I, I, I want to eat. I don't like the curry on the buffet. This is good. Mm. Very smooth curry. Really, not bad at all. I never thought I would ever say these words ever in my life, but Hello Kitty's ribbon is really tasty. Uh, even the exit is adorable. Check this out. Oh, I can't find my way out. I, I went through like four areas that I thought was the exit and then none of them were the exit. I feel like I'm trapped in, I feel like I'm trapped in Hello Kitty's dream right now. Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God, I was like, I was really worried for a second that I was like trapped in Hello Kitty purgatory. But, ah, uh, this place? You know what? If you like the cutesy stuff, if you like Hello Kitty, you like all that, you will love this place. This has got everything. It's got rides, it's got food, it's got performances and that crazy parade and a lot of stuff. But for me at the end, it was just, it was a little, it was getting a little too much for me. I, I craved something that wasn't pink. <laughs> All right, oh, it's gonna be out.